The socioeconomic gradient in health behaviours is well documented but poorly understood. For example, less educated people are more likely to drink heavily and smoke, and less likely to exercise and eat fruits and vegetables regularly. But the mechanisms behind such differentials are difficult to disentangle. There are strong mutual dependencies between the reef-building corals and reef-inhabiting fish, with many fish species depending on corals for food and habitat, while corals depend on the grazing by certain fish for reproductive success. Even the spread of coral diseases may be mitigated by fish. Luxurious and spacious, the rooms have timber verandas that offer uninterrupted views of the rose gardens. Some rooms have two queen beds, interconnecting suites and even a sofa bed, perfect for large families or groups. Bold colours, rich fabrics and an abundance of natural light enhance the sophisticated feel of the rooms, as do modern furnishings.
There is also a police family violence advisor in each region. Among other things, they are responsible for consultation with community agencies, identifying and reporting on local issues and trends in their region, and developing strategies to address them. The family violence advisors report to family violence managers, who in turn report to police and external committees. The majority of skin problems among healthcare workers that are related to hand hygiene are due to irritant contact dermatitis. Irritant contact dermatitis is primarily due to frequent and repeated use of hand hygiene products, especially soaps, other detergents and paper towel use, which result in skin drying. The initial use of alcohol-based hand rubs among such healthcare workers often results in a stinging sensation. Looking for a new home to buy can be a stressful, time-consuming and difficult process. Between trying to fit in inspections and deciding what you truly need in a property, it often isn't a quick process. If you purchase a property in a rush, you will likely get hit with buyer's remorse and start questioning whether you really made the right choice.
Recently, there has been much debate over Australia's heavy reliance on international students to the point where universities have been lax about admissions and grant them special treatment when it comes to gaining acceptance. A healthy number of international students in each country is a benefit. Students are exposed to different cultures, the university community becomes more diverse and inclusive, and the economy gains strength. You can reduce your risk of being mugged or robbed by taking a few simple precautions. It is a good idea to research the safety of your intended destination with the Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade. This government department keeps an updated bulletin on travel destinations, covering factors such as political unrest or criminal activities that target tourists. To perform its global environmental management, company must adopt an organizational approach linking its various functions and regions. To summarize, area of global companies includes its goods and services and its customers. Companies must cope up with forces in the specific and general environments.
but she and her colleagues have not noticed an increase in the number of people reporting them. While research has shown that people who have experienced trauma go on to experience trauma-related anxiety dreams, those who suffer general anxiety in their waking hours are not necessarily more likely to have anxious dreams. It's not just being more anxious that makes you likely to have anxious dreams. For many people, procrastination is a strong and mysterious force that keeps them from completing the most urgent and important task in their lives, with the same strength as when you try to bring like poles of a magnet together. It's also a potentially dangerous force, causing victims to fail out of school, perform poorly at work, put off medical treatment or delay saving for retirement. Using a smartphone for phone calls was more popular as age increased, whereas newer types of uses for phones in terms of using it more in terms of a mini computer for streaming videos, listening to music was more popular among the younger age groups. What this means is that generations are using the smartphones completely differently.
Behind the scenes, regulators have become increasingly active. The Productivity Commission has just released its draft report into the efficiency and competitiveness of the superannuation system, recommending some fundamental changes. But what do those outside the financial services echo chamber think about superannuation and their retirement? And how do their views compare with others around the globe? In studies of people facing trauma, many describe their experience as a catalyst for profound change and transformation leading to a phenomenon known as post-traumatic growth. Often when people have faced difficulty, illness or loss, they describe their lives as happier and more meaningful as a result. Unlike feeling happy, which is a transient state, leading a happier life is about individual growth through finding meaning. Individuals, governments and employers are becoming increasingly aware that baby boomers' retirement from the workforce will have a major bearing on Australia's economic and social well-being as well as the future of younger generations. However, empirical evidence for informing a productive and healthy retirement is lacking in current research and the recent financial crisis has called what little we do know into question.